All right, teams are in. We're underway. I appreciate the follow as well. Ivan should be on the field right now. Yeah, he's in the lobby. So we have Mako Gang one and one on the season versus V2 also one and one tier two div six winter circuit 2021 and this is what we watch on this channel not me playing rocket league for damn sure we did not <laughs> watch that this is what we want to see ivan nice touch there gets 50 midfield and they're looking fast nice demo there get him a body bag yeah Tunda collecting it, coming out of his corner. Looks like he wants a pass. He'll hop it up as Ivan Dupo. Du yeah, it's got to be Dupo, right? <laughs> Is up there for the shot, but it looks like he had a hard time getting around the ball to get a, a shot he liked. As big Q Dog puts it out. Ivan again with the missed touch off the wall. As Techors. Techers. Techors. <laughs> Gets the save there, good play by him. Now Ivan on the wall, he's had some missed touches already. Coming off the wall, pretty confident there. Runs out of boost. And King Ace Cookie. Did you guys know you're allowed to put <laughs> spaces in your names? Okay, maybe not on console. Okay, all right, I stand corrected. But King Ace Cookie. Nice demo there. Damn it, Bobby. Almost a shot from the King Ace. And if he would have got that shot, he could be named whatever he'd like. Because that was almost nasty. Touch there from Big Q. Ivan now up the wall. Trying to pass back down. No one quite ready to receive it, but it gets through both defenders. 50 there. King Ace puts it out. No touch. Ivan touches Tekras. Passes. Puts it on. Backboard. Another shooter. Another demo. Ooh. It's time to a pass in the back. Yeah, but that backflip though. As King Ace right back into the action and Cash is able to get the save there. Another demo. Why would you kill him like that? And this this one may be physical all the way through. It is a best of five series, so three wins will do it. Touch out there, big Q dog. Puts it down, Techors. Puts it up, and Cash is looking fancy in the air. But he does not get the shot off. And I think as we go on in this game, you know, it takes it takes uh, it takes games and and respective teams to to adjust to to the play, see what their opponents like. Another demo. Damn it, Bobby. So I think once both teams settle down, we're going to start seeing some crazy shots ring off here as the demos are in full effect right now. 0, zero two minutes left in game one. Touchdown, Tunda, captain of Mako game one to take advantage. It's Ivan it's looking good, good pass, a nice demo to clear the space. But a defender clears it out. I didn't see which V2 member that was. 50 there and a lot of pressure on V2 at the moment, but a big clear will remedy that. Touch there, Ivan on the ball. Goes up the wall, daring someone to go after it. He's out of boost. Nice 50 there. Doesn't really help in the boost department though. Drops it down to Cash. And it looks like Cash was expecting to do a little more. I'm not sure if Ivan perhaps said any, that in comms that he was out, but. Didn't look like Cash was ready. Nice shot there from King Ace. Cookie. 1 0 V2. Good play. Keep the change, you filthy animal. Bouncing in. Danaki, if you're still here, what did uh, what did the parents say about the about the stream? Did they like your uh Did, did they like it? Were they were they proud of their boy? <laughs> I know you guys lost, but it was a close one. Touch out back and forth down to a minute. So that one goal, as tight as this game one has been, you've got to appreciate the possibility that a demo there again. Boom, baby! 
But as I was saying, you have to appreciate the possibility that that may be the go-ahead goal. A great save by the King Ace, who's had key plays on both sides of the field, including this snipe right here, 2-0, 40 seconds left. I wouldn't venture out there, fellas. This sniper's got talent. And just plugs it in between the posts. Great play. And the ace is looking good early on. Kick off there. Nice win by Ivan. So they go into the corner. Cash. Up. Touching. Had the right idea, but did not connect with the precision that he was likely intending. Good touch there from Ivan. 50 there. Up around Techers. Puts it out to Cash. Hops it up. Ivan was not ready for that. A decent pass, but between positioning and, and just wherewithal, wasn't quite ready to address it. We are coming down to 10 seconds, and Cash is dribbling. Midfield gets two to bite on the fake. This one could be goal one, but Techers is right back in the game there. And they may win game one 2-0. And a great showing from V2. I do not anticipate Mako Gang taking all that line down. So looking for the bounce back here. As we got King Ace, 609, MVP, two goals, four saves, four shots. Shooting about 50%, but doing plenty as we have nine saves from V2. So obviously Mako Gang was able to put a lot of pressure on, but... None of it resulting in, in points as they get shut out in game one and stay at zero. As the console players a little slow to join here, they should be okay. There we go. Fury out here hating on consoles. <laughs> um, not at all. No, 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 I mean, because it bunches up your name together. That was like one of the big selling points for, for Steam for me is that you could be named whatever you want and you could put spaces, everything. You don't have to have all these exclamation points in the in the space of eyes or any of that. You can just be the name that you want. As Techers with a great 50 win and he gets to go 1-0. Nice steal. Nice steal. And a great play there by Techers. A great still. It looks like Cash was the third man back. And maybe now that the Meko gang is down 1-0, he's just feeling a little anxious and trying to get trying to force plays. But you have to keep that backfield discipline there. Good shot there from Cash as it does get 50. No save. Sean says XX underscore King 420. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> and Bob, Bob's always quick with the console hate. <laughs> Even though literally the best player on our team is console, as it is right now. And Big Q Dog is getting in on the action as well. What a snipe. Comes off of Tunda's nose. And Q Dog just sends it in. And they're out here repping for consoles. They're putting consoles on the mat. But think if he was PC. Uh, yeah, I, lie, I lay awake all night thinking if he was. And it, it should be soon. Cash up. Nice touch there from King Ace. Cookie. But a great big boom from Big Q. Captain of V2. And they're trying to redirect a pass or a shot right outside the goal. But turn into a double commit. Touch there, Cash. Puts it around. Nice put out by Tundas. Oh, sorry. It's Tunda. <laughs> As again, V2 has now matched their offensive output from game one. And it's kind of what I alluded to in the game prior. Is once, once both teams start getting settled, both of their, both of their shots it should be able to drop a little more as Tunda gets caught. Like a deer in the headlights in the net as this is goal three. Nice shot from Q as he lets that one go. Three goals for V2. 
shown. If you're good on console, you'll be even better on PC. Yeah, exactly. Exactly, exactly. King Cookie. Puts it on. Cash, look at the dribble, look at the pop. But Techers comes in to help on defense as he's rotating back. Pretty risky play, but it pays dividends there. Now Cash pops up, backflips, goes onto the ball, and gets met by two V2 members. You can never be good on console. <laughs> I don't think that's true either. Good touch from Tunda. He's trying to stay on the play, but King Ace intercepts in midair. Now gets boost, comes up, puts one on. Does he have another shooter? Big Q trying to go up. No touch from him. And Tunda should get this to go. And that is a travesty. Mako Gang is going to feel that one. Because they have plenty of time for a comeback, especially if they would have got that one to go. But now they're even in a more desperate situation than they had been prior to that play there. Pass in from Checkers. Touch! The missed touch! And goal four, perhaps, though, not quite cashes on the play. As Techers gives himself a nice shot in the quick chat. Infield pass from Tunda. Gets gobbled up by King Ace. And we are moving here. They're literally handicapped with 60 frames per second. Oh, yeah, I mean, it's a handicap. But if you're talking about, like, a between being a good Rocket League player and a bad Rocket League player, like, it could obviously be good. Obviously, they have a lower ceiling than a PC player. But uh, be it as it may, there's, there's plenty of uh, good console players. Nice 50 there. Going wall wide, blue corner. Demo. As we've been short. Short on those in this game too, but there was a flurry last game and they're coming out a little more. We're under 60 seconds here. Touchdown, bounce around, time to chase it back. Touch there, off the ceiling. King Ace almost lit the world on fire with that touch. Ivan puts it out. Not a lot of action there, but with a three goal deficit, this should be it for game two, and V2 is trying to work on the sweep here. As he gets the fake and gets a little cheeky there to shut this game two down. Keyboard and mouse controller problems. But you reckon you recognize the controller problems right away. Obviously, you have to buy a new one, but that's more of a financial thing than it is uh, Rocket League related. But V2 is coming out to make a statement and it's so this conversation is so funny as we have a console team literally dominating the field right now uh the captain big q dog 438 two goals assist to save helping out the boys seven shots from them and mako gang is gonna have to figure out something going forward here and we'll ready up as v2 is at match point Banter would say we could never lose to console players. <laughs> yeah, well, see, and that sounds something, uh, that sounds like exactly like something Banter would say. So I, I, I'm with him on that one for sure. That's the motivation they need. So coming around and another demo. Damn it, Bobby. And V2 is just beating up this Mako gang right here, but we've seen flashes of brilliance from from MG, so 
Let's see here. Ivan. Long boost gets robbed. Goes to the center. Tunda trying to stay on offense. Keep possession. Techers goes. Corner coming, rolling around. Big Q goes up. A nice shot from King Ace. Could have used a little more power and a little higher, but there was a lot of defenders there, but a good touch by him. Big Q pops it up. Tech is going around, gets the demo. Get him a body bag, yeah. Cash beats one man, stays on the ball, trying to preserve boost. He maintains 40, but loses the ball on the play. Tonda touches. Tecker's coming around. Touchdown, King Ace. Trying to dazzle us some more. Touching around in 0 0. And big Q Dog must be big because he 50s this right into blue goal. Just pure power and angle. Just gets the whole side panel of his octane. Good play there. And now V2 is up 1-0, and again, they have an opportunity to sweep here. Let's see if they can maintain. But now Tunda, Captain Omeko again, he's trying to rally the troops. He's trying to get them all behind him. Trying to make something happen. Good pass there, delivered. And Tunda recognized the situation and let it rip. Good play there. Another demo. <laughs> Touch around, touchdown, great pass is Cash! And this is what I was talking about. We 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 they've been getting their point across. Good pass here, and Cash is right on. I wouldn't venture out there, fellas. This sniper's got talent. And they just need a few more of those plays. Obviously, shore up on the defensive end. They allowed, if I remember correctly, four goals. And Techers and company respond immediately and put it back to a tie game. They're not going to let any easy wins go to Mako Gang here. Touch there, 50. Cheat up, demo. Ooh. Tunda puts it down outside the goal. Double commit on the clear. Let's see if that'll cost him because Cash is up immediately. Ivan now trying to come out of the corner. 30 boost to work with. A good pass. It's Tunda try to make the most of it. Another good pass. Cash wanted the, the two pass play, but it does not quite drop off for them there. Touch it around, goes up and Tunda, the captain trying to put the team on his back. Touch there. Now Mako Gang enjoying a rare lead here. Only by a goal, but you don't need much as they try to make it two there. I think that was Cash on the shot. Good play. He tried to string together. Did not work out for him as we remain 3-2. Lot of action outside. Good pressure from V2. When they turn on the heat, they really turn it on. Touch there from Techers goes out wide. Looks like Ivan tries to address it. Ball gets sent right back to his side of the field. Cash puts it out, gets dunked. 
and a nice put out off the backboard as he cleans it. Cash helps it along. Tecker's in a tight spot. He gets beat. 60 seconds left on the clock. 60 seconds of V2 is a goal and 50 seconds away from catching their first loss here in this series. Touching around Tunda. Up, oh, Tunda has had the hot hand in this game three, trying to prevent the 3-0 the sweep. Goes back, up off the backboard. Not put out with much power, but they're able to clear it of the goal. Good defensive sequence there. Touching, going around, flying. Perhaps the last shot off the backboard and the clear. No one was quite ready to handle that. Good play there. See, all they needed was the words of banter. <laughs> I, I think we actually do have a few of them in the chat, so you, you may be on to something. Let's go here to the stat lines. Tunda, 396, two goals. But really, really splendid goals, if I may say, on, on team play and individual. So great effort by him. He's just going to have to keep up that pace and have that effort met by his teammates, Cash and Ivan, who also had possibly the best game of the series for them as well. So here we are, Mako Gang trying to come back in the series 2-1. And now it's, now it's time to see how V2 responds. I've seen teams kind of psych themselves out after giving up a sweep opportunity. So let's see if V2 can, can stay on it and maintain control of the match and series to lock up their week three game here. King A sends it right back, pops up midfield. Nice pass, Techers. No, can't quite do it. It's now Cash is on offense. Devil there puts one on. And a shot from Tunda. It gives, it gives Cash the shot because the pass was on goal, but then Tunda comes up. But an amazing save there. And a great shot from Big Q Dog. As he loves shooting off of this wall here. Not a minute gone here. Tarina says, oh my. <laughs> and uh, yeah, Tarina if you're a banger, yeah, if you're just joining us, he's had two pretty much identical shots that he was able to pop off in game one. So he just really, really loves that wall. <laughs> and... Tiny, after seeing that that shot, says, I guess not on the comeback. <laughs> but, you know, it's still 1-0, still plenty of time. A Rocket League eternity, you could say. Let's see here. King Ace Cookie puts it out. Demo there. Puffy. Touch there out of the corner. Cash comes in, gets 50. A lot of action in midfield, but no one really taking taking control, taking possession. This one gets put down. Down to King Ace. Goes up around Ivan. Goes out of the corner, and that double touch may have costed a goal there because there was a shooter around that looked like he was itching to put that one in. Techers with the fake. Coming around, beats one man, but low on boost and wide on the shot. Good attempt there.
Pops down. Off the wall, Cash is hanging around. Cash, again, once he decides to go and he pulls the trigger on advancing and shooting, he's pretty lethal from the field. But he opts against it there as King Ace Cookie is going to take that gift of a goal. Let's see what transpired here. That was legitness. And a good adjustment from King Ace. With a good save initially, but does not clear the goal. Stays dangerous. His cash is up. Dripping it down. Goes off the backboard. Ivan tries to shoot. Tunda keeps it around. But they just run into a bit of a traffic jam of defenders in V2. Cash recovers on the half flip. Gets back. Big Q Dog tries to sneak one in. Techers is headed back to midfield, wants some boost. Maybe to rotate back into position as well. Nice touch there, that one will roll through. King Ace was in the way. Look at him dodge his play here. He goes around, turns, makes sure it doesn't need any additional help, and it doesn't go. Pyro's back, had to do a few scrims real quick. Nice, man. Good to hear. Glad you're getting the, the practice in. Touchdown, big Q dog. A good, a decent shot, but it would have been a gnarly pass if he had a shooter on that side of the field, but that's not how they're occupying the space. Touchdown, Cash. Goes around, Tunda on the play. Ivan goes, comes around, gets dunked. And at 40 seconds, I do not envision V2 dropping three goals in 30 minutes. Uh, nothing, not a really, not a commentary on Mako Gang's abilities, but V2 has just been locked down. And they're still scoring as goal, goal four almost goes there. But Mako Gang is trying to keep it close still. Good demo. Ooh. Up in the air, lands down. Off the wall, 10 seconds left. It's Ivan, points. A point for Ivan. Way to end on somewhat of a high note. All, all the little things count. As ironically, Ivan is the only console player for Mako Gang. But GG's tough loss. And now it is the interview portion of the stream here. So we have Tekra's MVP 487, one goal, two assists. Three saves and just a very good showing from that team there. So let me get this interview here. Gonna try to get Big Q on the on the line here. Q. What's up? What's up, man? Can you hear me? Okay. Yep. Awesome. How how you feeling, man? You guys are popping off for sure. <laughs> yeah, we feels good to win, especially after uh, us losing last week. So. Right. I I saw the record. Uh, both of you guys came in at one and one. So this is where things start getting a little crazy. We're at week three, obviously, and. 
Um, everyone starts jockeying for, for seeding positions or even just to make the playoffs. So uh, a big win against um, uh, a like, you know, a similar record there in Mako game. What were yeah. you seeing from them? What was that? What, what were you seeing from them on the field? Um, honestly, in the beginning, like the first game, I think we had complete control. And then after the, then or the second down. game, yeah, they started to like figure out what we did a little bit. So they put a little more pressure on us. Nice. Um, uh, who, but, who, who do you feel like giving the, the game ball to on the series? Um, if I can't pick me, I'll pick a... Well, hold on. Let's go on record here. You could definitely pick yourself if you want to go that route, but I, I think I think your boys might watch this back. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'll have to pick Techers or Steezy. Okay. Steezy. Techers. <laughs> Okay, he gets the game ball for this one. Okay, all right. It, any particular reason? Anything that you like that you saw from him? Um, plays pretty quick, which helps our whole team. Right. Uh, play quick, and then it sets up like good pass plays and stuff like that. Right, right. Yeah. And it was, so yeah, good. Uh, good game ball pick. Um, King Ace was the one just banging shots <laughs> off the wall from the field, so that stands out. But uh, yeah, you're you're one hundred percent right. Is uh. Those those players, those quick plays, those those challenges definitely facilitate um, you guys being able to to get everything else going. So it's it's pretty easy to recognize. Yeah. All right, man. But uh, we could cut it off there. I don't want to keep you too long. Or any uh, shout outs you want to give? Any uh, thing you want to plug? Anything else you want to mention? Um. I mean, we're looking for a, a um. We're a full like roster or whatever. So more um, subs. <laughs> like yeah, we could we could use a sub, but we're also uh, follow our team Twitter, it's at V Two Rocket League. All right, yeah, I might I might follow you guys then, but uh, yeah, you hear that chat? They're looking for for subs. You got to be good enough though, because you guys looked look damn good there. Um, <laughs> you said you lost last week. Yeah. What 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 did you see in in there? Did it go to full five games? No, we got three out. But oh man. I'm not. I'm not gonna blame it, but I was lagging a lot because there's a huge snowstorm where I live. Uh, so okay, okay. Wasn't the full potential of our team. Right. Well, yeah. You know, hopefully, I've I saw a lot last circuit where teams uh, got to play against a team and then catch them again in the playoffs and kind of get that revenge game going. So maybe you guys can get something like that. Oh yeah, we're looking for revenge. <laughs> All right, man. Well, congrats and good luck going forward. Yep. Thank you. Later. All right, that was Big Q, captain of V2, and uh, just a good performance from them. I'm sure everything they would have hoped for. Trigger Happy says, sounds like console. <laughs> no, it doesn't. You're... <laughs> you're... Trigger Happy, I better not see you in the news uh, that you were arrested for like a hate crime against someone that's a console player. All right, you, you take it easy in there. Tiny Longleg says, any matches after this? Well, Tiny, funny you should ask, because, don't worry, Banter hates them more than me. Well, I don't want to see either of you in jail. <laughs> no one has, I like how you say, you don't say, no, 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 we won't go to jail for something like that. You just say, well, don't worry, Banter hates them more than me. 